Good morning guys. Welcome back to another video. It is Wednesday, July 26th. Um, I am actually at my physical therapy. Um, I have an appointment at 8 o'clock and it is 7.39. So I just got here so I'm going to wait a little bit and then go inside for my physical therapy. Lots to, think, lots to do today. Um, um, so after my physical therapy, I have to go home and clean my house a little bit. Um, and then I am going, me and David, we're going to go see a new house. Um, hopefully we'll be able to move into this house because uh, as far as like seeing the pictures, we really love it. So I'm going to take you guys along with that. And then afterwards, Holden has his VPK um, orientation. So lots of things to do today. Um, we will be seeing Hayden this evening. My um, my mom is going to be seeing him today because I told him I told her that um, I'm going to be really busy today. Um, so and you know I want at least somebody to see him today. So she's gonna be seeing him and yeah so i'm gonna take you guys along um for this busy busy day all right so i just got done with my session it was good for the first session um there were some exercises or stretches i would say that was a little bit harder than others um one thing i did enjoy was the last part they did like these electrical wires attached to my back and they put like this heating pad on my lower back it, it was amazing um these wires helped control my pain and it, they were like i don't know it's kind of hard to explain like electrolyte or electric something that was like controlling my pains and stuff it felt good and with the heating pad oh that felt great too so yeah it was a, a success uh, session. I can't wait to go back because, you know, that really did help my back. Um, but yeah, so now I'm going to go and um, go to the daycare and see my kids for a little bit because um, I haven't really seen them. All right, just got done visiting with the kids. A little bit of emotional. Liana is very attached to me and she did not want to leave me and I'm just so emotional because I know they really miss me but at the same time I gotta be there for Hayden and she just does not understand that I have to go I have to do a couple things and I have to be there for Hayden and she just she doesn't understand that why Hayden's in the hospital and and this is why I wanted to visit them because I know that they miss me and I miss them and she usually doesn't do this when I drop them off and stuff like that she usually she usually doesn't cry and say stay 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 but since she hasn't really seen me she gets very attached um so it's just my heart breaks when she really wants me and she wants me to stay and and she literally was waving at me at the fence she was the last one into um you know the classroom because they were outside for a recess and um so she was the last one and she was just waving to me mommy please stay mommy don't leave and it's just it's a, it's a little bit of emotional because I wish that I can be there for everybody and unfortunately I can't be there for everyone so it's just hard it's really really hard so right now I am on my way to go get David because he was supposed to take the sun rail but I have to go get him because our clothes wasn't done from the washer and dryer, so I'm gonna have to go drive back to the hospital and then we'll have to drive right back over here 
and um yeah and then we'll have to go see the house and then later do the vpk orientation so all right guys i'm finally back home for a little bit i'm gonna clean up a little bit of my house get things a little bit tidy up um and then David will pick me up so we can go see a house. All right, I just cleaned the house. I feel a lot better and accomplished. So I'm just waiting on David to pick me up so we can go and see the house. So I was just on TikTok Live. So if you guys haven't followed me on TikTok or anything, um, I have four counts. I have Alicia R. White, my second, Alicia R. White 95, third, Alicia underscore inspiration, and the fourth one, Dancing with Chaos. Those are my four counts on TikTok. So, yeah, I'm just resting. Done a lot of work today. Yeah, I feel so proud of myself. So we are at the hospital, we're in the parking garage now, we're about to walk in and sign in and so we can go visit Hayden. We did look at, at the house, um, it is beautiful, it's massive. I didn't get to film because the people were still um, living there and I didn't want to like intrude by filming. But let's just say it is perfect for our family. So, um, I'll go into a little bit more details later after I see Hayden. So, I am here with Hayden. He's very agitated. But I was just rubbing his chest area and that made him calm down. But I guess they have like a little DVD player for him. And of course the bubble machine but it looks like he does not have his g-tube in his nose i'm assuming he kept taking it out so maybe they took it out um but he is just when i got here he um he really wants to be on his belly and he doesn't want to be here so but hopefully tomorrow will be a better day for him. Hopefully he'll he won't have to lay flat all the time tomorrow. But we'll see. It all just depends on him and how the doctor feels about him sitting up a little bit. But it's a process, guys. It's a process. But he's hanging in there. He's not happy though. He's surely not happy. But we're trying to make him better and I know being on your back is very painful because I've had back surgery so I know how he feels about being uncomfortable and but we're gonna get through this and he's gonna get through it. And hopefully he'll be able to walk in the future get all that strength in his legs <laughs> he looks like he's kind of out of it good morning guys I am walking to the parking garage because today I'm going to work so I have a shift from uh, 9.30 to 2.30 and um, so I'm going to be getting the car and picking David up at the Ron McDonough house. Um, his ankle is, uh, is throbbing and it's hurting so he's going to go to urgent care for that. Um, so yeah. Today I work and tomorrow I work and hopefully Hayden um, is going to be, uh, what is it, 
he'll be able to eat foods and um, be able to move around and not be on his back. So we're, hope, we're hoping for a better day for Hayden and tomorrow so that he'll be able to go home tomorrow. Hopefully he can come home tomorrow, but we will see. All right, guys, so I'm just waiting until David comes out, but I want to talk about um, the house that we saw yesterday. It is beautiful. It is so perfect for us. Um, they listed it as a five-bedroom, three-bathroom three home, but technically it could be a six-bedroom because there is a office den downstairs that has like a double doors with glass. And so if we do get this house, we would turn that into a guest bedroom so that <coughs> so that the boys um, would share a room, like all of them wouldn't be sharing a room. So we, we would have um, Holden and Weston share a room and then Winston and Easton share a room so that they're not all together in one room because that would be pretty crowded. Um, and then of course Leanna will get her own room because she's the only girl and then Hayden There is actually a bedroom downstairs Which is wonderful because that's what we need and not a lot of houses have a bedroom downstairs so um, So the his room would be a little bit small, but that's okay because he really doesn't need a big room and um, there's a full bathroom downstairs the only thing is it there's a shower but there's no tub um but we do have we haven't even used it yet but um he does have like this um special needs uh shower chair um that he can use um when we give him a shower and stuff we'll buy like one of those um shower heads where we can just pull it down and then bathe them and stuff um but yeah like everything is beautiful it's like bigger than our current home right now and it's a screened in patio in the back and there's also a front patio too um so it's just gorgeous all around there's a loft upstairs it's a big loft so of course we're gonna put that as a playroom um, it's bigger than the playroom that we have right now. The master bedroom is huge. It has a tub, it has a shower, and it has two huge walk-in closets. I think this home is just perfect for us. And yeah, I'm really hoping um, that we do end up getting this house that the owner chooses us. Um, so we'll see and I'll keep you guys updated, but I think this house is so perfect for us in many ways. Um, so yeah, I'm really hoping. Um, the move-in dates, um, the house would be available like around September. Um, well, hopefully sooner because like we're not in a rush to move because um, we can take our time. So yeah. We'll see how how this plays out and hopefully we'll get the house. We are going to see Hayden. Yeah, we got Chick-fil-A on our way here. <laughs> <laughs> we are with Hayden. He is doing much better now. He is in his green bed now. And he's at a different room. He got transferred over to the special room. Uh -huh. So <laughs> he's very uncomfortable right now. He's trying to get comfortable, but, but overall he's recovering really well. And he's just mad because he can't get comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. But it looks like his incision is pretty small. So
he was a he was having a hard time finding a comfortable position and everything. I tried cradling him. I tried having him on my chest. That did not work. But I am so glad that he is finally sleeping peacefully. Good morning, guys. So I'm walking to the parking garage. Obviously, I have work today because I have my uniform on. But I'm going to go and get the car for David because his ankle is still bothering him. So, um, update on Hayden. Hayden is doing really, really well. He might get discharged on Sunday. But he's just really, really frustrated because of the fact that he cannot use his legs anymore. And he's not paralyzed, but he has to retrain his legs. And he has to build up that strength again in his legs. So that's what's frustrating for him. Um, so that's why when he gets discharged and stuff, he's going to have intensive therapies. So that he can work up and build up, build up that strength. Um, but yeah, overall he's doing really well. So I have a shift today from 9.30 to 4.15. So it's a longer shift today. So yeah. Oh, and also I forgot to mention that after work, I'm going to be having the kids... My mother-in-law has to go back home. So I'm going to be picking up the kids um, and having the kids over the weekends while Hayden's in the hospital. So anyways, um, so yeah, I'm going to be with the kids this weekend and hopefully Hayden will get discharged on Sunday. Um, that's the goal, but... We will see what happens. So, yep. All right, guys. I have all the kiddos besides Hayden. Hayden is actually getting discharged today. So, actually, I just got off the phone with David, and they're actually on their way home. So, Hayden's out of the hospital, and we'll get to see them when we get home. I got some groceries to put away. What a happy Friday, guys! Yay! Yay! Happy Friday! <laughs> so guess who is home? Hi, Hayden. Hi, Hayden. <gasps> Hayden's home! Hayden's home! Mwah. Love you! Hayden's home! We are so happy he is home now. So happy. So happy. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Mommy, it is look, Saturday. Look, mommy. Yeah, I know. I see that. Good morning, off. Winston. Mommy, can, can you fix this? Baby? I will fix that later. I am literally half asleep. Huh? I'm so tired. Uh oh. I'm literally so tired. Uh oh, mommy. I'm tired. Mommy, come here. Hmm. See the fan? Mama, come here, my bed. See the fan? Mommy, look. Look, Mommy. Yeah, I know. Mommy, look, Mommy. Oh, can, can time you for breakfast. Can you fix my sticker up there? Um, yeah, later. No, no, that. It's time to get Winston changed and then go downstairs oh, for that. breakfast. Good morning, Hayden. Good morning. <laughs> hey, good morning, good morning, good morning. Just hanging out with the kiddos. Weston doesn't feel so good. He's hot. He feels very hot. Well, uh, Holden and Leanna, please stop doing that. We're just chilling. My back is killing me, though. Hi, Winston. Corn. 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 Corn over here. 
right guys, it is the evening on Saturday. What a lazy day, which I need. Hi. Hi. He's just eating a snack. But I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope you guys had a wonderful Saturday. Well, why you bye? Then me. I want to say bye. Okay, say bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Okay, say bye. Bye. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> Anyways. Um brain brain fart. Um they distracted me. Oh yeah. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on those notification bells. And I'll see you guys in like I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.